This is the 13 Eyewitness News Sports Desk, driven by your central Indiana Chevy dealers. Hi, everybody. It is hard to believe we are two weeks away from Christmas, and the Indiana Pacers' wish list is short right now. They want a victory over the Boston Celtics tonight. Boston coming to town second in the East, and they feature some big names in the history of Indiana high school and college basketball. They represent Indiana's big three schools. Who can ever forget IU's Romeo Langford or Purdue's Carson Edwards? And then there's the Butler Bulldog, Gordon Hayward, all now wearing the famous Celtics green. Being back home, is it still special to be, come back and get to play against this team you grew up watching? It's always special um, to play in front of friends and family and get a chance to visit for a little bit. It's definitely always special. A lot of ticket requests. Have you gotten out of that business? <laughs> uh, yeah, I think I've sorted that out um, over the years. So um, still going to have a lot of people here, though. Hayward knows the drill when it comes to visiting for a game. You got to take care of business before family. And Coach Brad Stevens is the same way. He grew up in Zinesville and, of course, was the Butler coach. It's always great to be back. Um, you know, I love being back. These, these work trips are quick. So, you know, you know, I learned very early on that you can't meet up with anybody and, you know, you just kind of keep your head down and stay in the season. But it's still great to drive down the street and, and be back in this building and, and um, you know, with Butler on last night. It's fun to watch, and so it's, it's always good to be back. Former Mr. Basketball Romeo Langford is cleared to play tonight. He's been dealing with an ankle injury, but he's ready to lace up the shoes with lots of family and friends watching him tonight as he adjusts to being in the NBA. Is it all what you thought it would be? I mean, a dream come true here? Uh, I mean, yeah, it is. Um, it's, it's fun, actually, just having just to play basketball and not to worry about nothing else besides that. It's, it's fun to do that. Former Purdue star Carson Edwards is also learning the ropes of playing in the pros. He's having fun along the journey. Overall, just, just continue to learn overall, but probably there's a lot of ways I'm trying to adjust, but just just changing just how long the season is, man, and just understanding just some nights you don't play and some nights you will sometimes, you know, just finding a role and trying to perfect it and be the best you can at that role is something that I'm learning and uh, biggest adjustment for me. What have you seen from Carson and Romeo, having a couple of local boys on the squad with you here? Yeah, I mean, they're both... You know, tremendous players. Carson can fill it up quick, as everyone here in the state knows. And, and Romeo is, um, you know, such an athletic slasher, uh, can do a little bit of everything. Been really impressed with his playmaking ability. So let's see how this homecoming goes tonight. Hopefully Gordon, Carson, and Romeo will be nice to the Indiana Pacers. I'm Dave Calabro at Bankers Life Fieldhouse.